but I was just playing the flute to um, express the energy that I want this, this mural to have so that when the community sees it, it's going to be a mural that expresses good energy and positive energy. The idea actually came from an Arvada resident who lives in this area and the Arvada Arts and Cultural Commission thought it was a great idea. It's really a very visible area. The blank wall here before could only be improved upon. It's close to an Arvada park and we felt like it'd be a great place for a mural. I wanted to connect it to the post office, but I also wanted to have an important story behind it. When I was younger, my mom used to send uh, letters to my grandmother in Guadalajara. It's hard to be away from your family, and, and all, if you only have this connection is this letter, then it's really important. And each of these animals is also represents a chapter in your life or a person that maybe had an impact on you. So each character has its own different types of symbol, and each symbol will be portrayed in the final letter when it gets to the end. Marco really stood out to us, and really from a sense of his style, from a creativity, as well as really blending that with the story. Looking at it, I love how dynamic and vibrant it is. I really like having it on the post office. I think it's a great fit. The Arvada Arts and Cultural Commission's mission is really to strengthen the community fabric through public art and also to support Colorado artists and in addition to that really just to make our community more beautiful to live in. It's important for people to have art in their lives because it's an energy and this energy is inspiring and it's necessary for our well-being and it's also letting the community know that we care about you. This is for you, it's a gift for you.